What is going on guys? Grave here. Welcome back to Rainbow Six Siege. And yesterday afternoon we did receive update 1.84. There's a lot of bug fixes in this. No changes to uh, operators like, you know, changes of, of lethals, tacticals, weapon damage, sights, anything like that. All of the changes within this were bug fixes for gameplay, certain operators, of course, map design, that kind of thing. I'm going to link all this down in the description because I'm going to go over the general fixes. I'm not going to go into each operator's, you know, fix they had for any kind of mainly gadgets and things not working correctly with the environment. If you would like to read over each operator's change for their, you know, bugs or, or things that they were experiencing with some of these operators, you're more than welcome to read these patch notes, like I said, listed down in the description. I'm going to go over all the general fixes that are a lot of these things that people have been talking about within the community. Of course, inconsistency with debris and sound issues along with explosion issues with the FS SFX have all been worked on within this update. Of course, spamming gadget, equip and unequip would cause some shield operators to take longer to equip their shield. That has been fixed. Incorrect animations when performing certain actions. And when ADS, some parts of the scope would go in and out of focus. So all of this has been updated and fixed with yesterday's update. Also, various operator visual animation issues and operator shields will flip if going prone right after a melee has also been fixed. Now, when it comes to certain operators, Blackbeard, Castle, Clash, Echo, Maestro, Maverick, Knock, Montaigne, Yana, Jackal, Legion, Oryx, Sledge, and Zofia have all had things worked out bug-wise. Now, like I said, these are no, no, no things that are, are including, you know, weapon damage changes, sight changes, gadget changes, anything like that. These are all problems that these uh, characters were experiencing while on maps or certain maps where things were not working correctly with those particular characters. Now, when it comes to level design, gadget deployment inconsistencies within certain maps, also, inconsistency issues with destruction of some map props has been fixed. Also, various problematic LOS issues on maps. Some pixel peaks and spawn peak spots on maps have also been fixed. Uh, various visual or cosmetic fixes on maps and map assets. Various clipping and dynamic clipping issues with maps. Various clipping and dynamic uh, clipping assets on certain maps. Also, various lighting issues for dark spots on maps. Some collision issues with maps for the drones or the operators have been fixed. When using a breaching charge on the lower section of a barricaded window, it destroys only the top layer of the adjacent floor. Some wall types do not take bullet damage when shot from a certain angle or a certain side. On bank specifically, players can go OOB from the police barricade. Of course, Oryx can go through the wall using his dash in the 2F armory desk on border. That has been fixed. And... Habana's uh, gadget itself would have no collision with the desk at the 1F lobby on consulate. Now, when it comes to Oregon, they also had some map, uh, fixes just for Oregon specifically because Oregon has been completely redone. So there are seeing some bugs or some issues with Oregon inconsistent with vaulting and issues on, on is and some areas and issues on areas of Oregon. There were vaulting problems. Uh, the ceiling fans on Oregon did not have the correct sound. Players could get stuck after vaulting in certain areas on Oregon. Um, the indestructible wooden shelf and 1F, uh, 1F meeting hall in Oregon has been fixed. Valkyrie's black eye could be hidden inside a flower pot on 1F lobby that has also been fixed. And various areas where players could still receive damage from outside indestructible walls on Oregon has also been fixed. Now when it comes just to general fixes for all maps, there was a lot of overlapping running sounds that has been worked on. And the duplicated running sounds have also been worked on. I have noticed that myself over the past few weeks when I have played that sometimes you would hear your footsteps like twice. I'm not quite sure what was going on with that. Players receive matchmaking error, errors when making full squad and trying to go into an unranked match. Minor visual and menu HUD fixes, various shop and cosmetic fixes, various spectator mode fixes, uh, various minor menu and HUD fixes. Also, for bright light sources and bright light cosmetics, the lens effects would bloom. Lens flex, uh, the lens flare was way too bright. That has also been fixed. The infinite loading screen on the menu has been fixed. And the thumbnail texture for maps on the map tab or the playlist guide has also been fixed. Like I said, guys, this is all just bug fixes. If you would like to read over some of the bug fixes they did for each individual operator, I'm going to link those, like I said, down in the patch notes in the description. I just didn't want to drone on for 10 or 15 minutes of this video. I was trying to get out, you know, all the general fixes the quick, quickly as possible. But like I said, guys, this is all just quick fixes. Nothing really changing gameplay-wise. Uh, they did say that they will not have as many small updates in the future. 
uh, because of everything that's going on in the world right now. They said expect larger updates kind of at a slower pace until everything gets back to normal in the world because a lot of these companies are not at work. They're working from home. So they said it's going to be a bit slower when it comes to updates. Anyway, guys, if you like the video, make sure you hit the like. If you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you are a subscriber, click the bell icon in the top right corner. Make sure you share the video. It does help out the channel a lot. And be sure to check out the affiliate GT Racing. They sell gaming chairs and office chairs, and all their information is linked down in the description. And I'll catch you next time. Peace.